Uh, the Jets knock oh, off Kansas God. City? What are you doing, Aaron? <laughs> I swear to God, if the Jets make the Super Bowl. <laughs> What is going on YouTube? I'd like to welcome you guys back to Red's World. We're going to be getting into a Madden sim of what's going to happen this season in the NFL. We're going to be going up to week eight, telling you guys about the midpoint, and then we're going to be seeing who wins the Super Bowl, how players do, so on and so forth. And joining me today is my buddy Conley. Hello. Week one is finally here in, in, in the video game world. What's your predictions for the upcoming season? Who do you think is going to be in the Super Bowl? Who do you um, think is going to win the AFC North? So I hate to be this guy, but it's hard for me to bet against the Chiefs in Madden and in real life. Sheesh. Uh, the Jets. No, nah, I'm just playing. Um, I hate to be this guy. I hate to be this guy because I don't, I don't think since he's going to get there, but since he's a contender, I think since he has a chance and I think, um, I'm going to go since he, man, I think those are two pretty safe bets to be honest with you. I'm going to pick a ballsy pick here. I'm going to give it to Dallas. Dallas is a good Madden Sim team. I like it. Uh, yeah. I mean, I like the chiefs pick a lot. They're, they're hard to beat. They're hard to beat, but I gotta go with Joe Burr and the Bengals. As much as I hate to say that, uh, I'm gonna go with the Bengals and the Bills in the AFC Championship. And the NFC is kind of a it's kind of a crapshoot, but I'd probably go with Dallas and Philadelphia. I think yeah, Philadelphia I was, th I was thinking Auburn. the same thing. All right, so you guys have Cincinnati. our predictions. What we're gonna do now is we're gonna sim halfway through the season. And we're going to tell you guys what's going on at that point. We're looking at Mac Jones, surprisingly, being the passing leader. Um, he has six That's less touchdowns insane. than Patrick Mahomes, but he's got more yardage and a higher completion percentage. And then Kirk I Cousins. That. I, I think everybody that's a hardcore NFL fan was going into this year saying, you know what, halfway point, Mac Jones is going to have a higher completion percentage. Yeah, I mean, it's common knowledge. More yards than Patrick Mahomes. And on a more actually believable note, Derrick Henry's leading the league in rushing. I can um, definitely see that. But John Robinson looks like he's going to be the workhorse in Atlanta. Good pickup by the Falcons for the rookie running back. Well, receiving, we got Cooper Cup. As to no surprise, Chris Olave, OH, um, and Justin Jefferson. One touchdown for Jefferson, though? That's crazy. The who the fuck yeah, is Kirk well, Cousins I mean, passing it to? <laughs> that is nuts. Of course, Aaron Donald leading the lead in sacks. Okay, so we're going to break down the top five teams for each side. So right now we got the Titans, who are undefeated which is extremely surprising. So number two is the Bills, as to no surprise. Go on with your uh, prediction there. You got to ride it out. Dolphins, that's surprising. And then we got the Bengals. The honorable the mention Dolphins. is the Chiefs. They're down here at five and two. The Dolphins, I mean, their big injury they have is Jalen Ramsey, who is out okay. the whole year on IR. Okay. Well, on the NFC side, we have the Falcons are six and one, which... Again, surprising. Uh, led by that running game, the Rams are five and two. The Vikings, surprising, four and three with two leaders, which is crazy. Um, and then the Panthers, the Cowboys are two and four. <laughs> oh wow! All right, let's let's jump ahead eight more weeks and see what's going on. So we yeah. are in the playoffs. Before we do the playoff deep dive, let's let's just look at the stats. So we're going into the wild card week. Our passing leaders are. Dak Prescott from out of nowhere, Patrick Mahomes, and Kirk Cousins. Dak Prescott is 4,600 yards with 36 touchdowns. He, uh, he must have had a good second half of the season. Uh, again, no surprise, Derrick Henry with 1,700 yards, 15 touchdowns. It murdered it this year. Uh, Aaron Jones. Look at Austin Eckler with yeah, 20 yeah. touchdowns. 20 touchdowns is impressive. Receiving Cooper Cup, still holding that number one spot. George Pickens and uh, Michael dog. Gallup. Dog. George Pickens is a dog. Dog. <laughs> and then we got sack leader. Again, no surprise. Aaron Donald, 20 sacks. Von Miller, which is surprising to see up there. And Max Damn, Crosby. Damn, he came out of his casket to fucking <laughs> I see get that. some sacks. <laughs> Okay, so right off the bat, the Eagles are in. Dallas is not in. So I'm already wrong. 
Um, on the other side, we do have the Bengals. And we do have the Kansas City Chiefs. The The Bengals are first-round bye. Yeah, I mean, Atlanta's doing something right. I mean, that's the only thing I can think of is uh, B. John Mustard is uh, <laughs> he's carrying them to the playoffs. Uh, the surprising one is the Giants getting in at number five on the NFC side. I think the Giants, yeah. that's the, the NFC East is just apparently death row. Uh, the hey, NFC West. And other news, everybody. Aaron Rodgers got the Jets to the playoffs. <laughs> oh, I've seen that. The NFC, uh, the NFC West is looking tough. The Niners, the Rams, and Seahawks all made it. And then we got the, the Packers, surprisingly. Uh, number one, Bills Ravens. Who you got? I'm going to have to go with Bills. Lamar can't play quarterback. Shoosh. We got Kansas City versus the Titans. That one's tough. That is a I'm good game. I'm going to have to. Yeah, because. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to with, uh, I'm gonna have to go with KC because, I mean, Tennessee just. Brian Tannehill ain't him. Okay, and then Jaguars Jets. <laughs> I know Jackson. I know Jacksonville's probably like, hey Trevor Lawrence. Uh, I I know. I want to say the Jets, but I'm gonna give it to the Jets. Oh, man. I'm gonna give it to the. I'm Jets. gonna go Jags. So for me, so, I, so what? I, I'm gonna go Bills as well, and then I'm gonna go Titans on the underdog pick, and then I'm gonna go Jets. Okay. And on the NFC side, you got Philadelphia and San Francisco. I'm going Eagles. I like I'll, it. I'll, I went Green with the, Bay. I went with the NFC East before I got to. So, uh, gr- yeah, LA you're locked into the big. LA, LA, a hundred percent. Oh LA. yeah, for sure. And then, and then Seattle. And I'm gonna New give York, it. I'm gonna give it to the Giants, match. man. I'm gonna give it to the Giants. I'm I'm relying on Saquon. And Mac Jones. Mac Jones had a good half of the year. I'm going to have to go with the Eagles because I, I came out of the NFC East too. Then I'm going to take the Rams. Matty Stafford. He's uh he's on his comeback revenge tour. Again. And then I don't... <laughs> yeah, yeah, again. You left me to die for, what, 11 years in Detroit? Fuck you guys. <laughs> yeah. Here's a Super Bowl ring to show for it. Uh, man. Nobody deserves that fate. I'm going to have to go with uh, Seattle. Okay. Geno Smith. Take me home, Country Roads. DK Big WVU Metcalf. guy. Okay. All right. Let's see what happens. So, the Ravens shocked both of us. Then got the AFC yeah. North up there representing. The Titans lost a close one. And the Jets, as I suspected, won. We got the NFC East is completely out. <laughs> We got San Fran, and we got the Packers, and we got... I, I, something told me that the Packers were going to win because we both went against them. Same with the Ravens. And then Seattle destroyed the Giants. Jesus Christ. Yeah, thirty. the 20-5 to 5 score is kind of ridiculous. All right. I'm just... Bengals-Ravens. God, I don't even know what I'm going Bengals, man. I'm, I'm, that's that's yeah, a no-brainer. I'm, I'm going Bengals, too, because I hate the rat birds. So bad. <laughs> uh, Kansas City, it's not even close. Aaron Rodgers is too old. He can go back to some mountain drinking his weird ass tea. <laughs> All right. Falcons, 49ers. I'm going to have to go with the 49ers. I'm going to go with Bijan. I think the defense is just too tough. I agree, but I'm going to go with him. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> And then Packers, Seattle. I'm going to go Seattle. Seattle yeah, had a shutout Seattle and a 30-point game. I'm going to Seattle. Yeah, I'll take Seattle. I'm going to put my faith in DK and old Gino. Well, let's be disappointed again. <laughs> uh, the Jets knock oh, off Kansas City. What are you doing, Aaron? Okay, Bijan lost. Bijan, the Falcons. Hey, hey Ron. Hey, hey, Ron. In Seattle won. This is going to be an interesting... Man. Oof. I, I, okay. AFC, Bengals. Um, NFC, I don't know. <laughs> Man, I'm going to have to go with the Bengals for sure. <laughs> I swear to God, if the Jets make the Super Bowl. <laughs> oh, no, that's what I'm... Uh, let me look and see if there's any injuries. Ooh, or without DK Metcalf. Mm. 
and Kenneth Walker. The okay. Third. I'm going to switch that to the 49ers then. Because <laughs> yeah. they're going to have a hard time on that defense running the ball. Oh, but the 49ers are missing their all-world left tackle, Trent Williams. Man, well, I still Ugh. got the 49ers. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to have to go with Bengals 49ers in the Super Bowl, which I'm pretty sure, and I could be wrong about this, but I know everything there is to know about football. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the Bengals have only played the 49ers in the Super Bowl and has lost every time. That, I think you're very correct about that analytic. All right, we got San Fran and the Bengals and the Super Bowl. And Aaron Rodgers kept it fucking close. Yeah. Hey, shout out to the man Aaron, because that is rough. He did it with less. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> so, who we got here, man? I'm going to be honest, first seed versus seventh seed, I'm going to have to give this to the Bengals again, man. Yeah, I'm going to have to go with the Bengals because, uh, yeah, I'm just... <laughs> they're they're too strong. I mean, that offense is crazy. 49er fans, cross your fingers. You got any pre- you got final score predictions? Mm, score. I'm gonna say no, nah, I'm gonna say 31 to 17. Who you I was going to say 35-17 Bengals. Okay. Yeah, I have to do that. Sheesh. Okay, cool. It does say the yearly. So we got Coach of the Year, Zach Taylor, Cooper Cup, won the Offensive Player of the Year, Aaron Donald, Defensive Player of the Year, Bajon Robinson, and Jack Campbell. Okay. And Cincy wins the Super Bowl. Gets the revenge. Hey, San Fran, there you guys have it. Cincinnati is going to win the Super Bowl, according to Madden. Aaron Rodgers is going to get to the conference championship. All right, so if you guys want to see more Madden content, make sure you like the video. Uh, Next time, we're probably going to do some fantasy league stuff like that. We we got a lot of ideas, but this is the kind of content we're going to be pumping out for the next month or two. And then come October, I'll be playing a lot of horror games. But thank you guys for coming to Red's World. Stay tuned for more to come soon, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Bye.